So good morning from Curry Motor Speedway. It's day two of the JK Tire FMSCI National Racing Championship, and the 250 Cup is, I think, so going to start right now. Uh, so today it's going to be a much more eventful day. We're probably going to get around in one of the safety cars. We'll be taking an interview of the driver of the safety car. Uh, we'll be talking to some people from M Sport again, just like last year. And my boy Chetan is driving for them this year. So it's going to be an action-packed day. And let's see how it goes. So right now I am sitting inside the safety car and I'm waiting for the safety driver to come and last year the safety car was an AMG, this year it's an E-Class but nonetheless I'm super excited. I didn't get a chance to sit in the safety car last year so basically I have to sit inside this thing for the entirety of this race that's gonna happen. So I'll be asking the driver a few questions as to you know how he's gotten into this, you know what was he doing before he got this job opportunity and a couple of more questions along those lines so stay tuned for that and this is super cool I mean you have wires and a lot of things here and there everywhere so yeah I want to see what all of this thing, these things do. Mr. Abhilash and he's the official safety car driver for the JK NRC. So, sir, I just wanted to ask you, how long have you been doing this for? I think more than 10 years now. And like, what were you exactly, like what, what form of motorsport were you driving in before this? No, no, I'm a rally driver basically and I still uh, is into that. And I drive the safety car for the JK series. And uh, what would you say is the favorite part of this job? <laughs> Technically, the safety car is deployed when there is an incident on the track to control the pace of the race. So, ten, like, you know, preferably we don't like to use the safety car because every time we use it, that means a number of laps is reduced. But still, when there is an incident where it has to be, like, you know, uh, taken care of, the car has to be removed so that the race can uh, resume. So then only it is deployed. Otherwise, safety is always on a standby. So. The fun part is actually not using the safety car more. <laughs> right. Got it, got it. And have you ever driven any of the cars, like the LGB F4 cars? No, no, no single seater set. Okay, okay, got it. Thank you so much. Sure. I have time, I have time. Okay, perfect. So, we just hopped out of the safety car, it was an amazing experience, I mean it's kind of wrong to say that I got the full safety car experience because we were crashed out, you know, a lot of bad luck for a couple of the drivers but at least I got the experience and it's a very important job to make sure everyone is safe and you know just in harmony and not creating any further chaos so very important job this man over here has so uh, now we'll head into the pits, we'll try to find our boy Chetan because we want to talk cars and motorsport with him so let's see if we can find him in the pits he's driving for M Sport and he's doing some great stuff today. So 
So this over here is uh, Chetan's car. Now he's not here yet, but I can just tell you a couple of differences between this car, which is a pro class car, and a novice car, which is one back over there. And there's Chetan. Let me know when you're free. Are you free now? Are you free now? Keep your laptop and come. So this suspension has. Uh, it's basically inboard, so you get the shell and everything over this. Whereas the novice car, it's more of a conventional setup. You have the springs and the strut over here. So this is a pro class car. That's a novice car. We'll, we'll wait for Chetan now. So this is Chetan. Uh, I think so. He's been riding a couple of years in this championship. Uh, last year you were in a different team. So what made you change teams? It wasn't exactly changing teams uh, per se. It was actually I jumped. Categories. I was okay. in the Novice Cup last year and I actually jumped from the Novice Cup to the LGB Formula 4s. And uh, let's say Momentum Motorsports did not exactly have a car uh, in the LGB F4 category. So I had to jump to the next best option. So I thought M4 would be the best option available right now. Okay, and I think so you were driving the Novice car last year and yeah. this year you're driving the Pro car. Yeah. So what is the difference? in between both cars? Uh, there's quite a bit of difference uh, from the chassis side to the handling side, suspension setup, everything. Yeah. And the novice class... Okay, wait, wait. So the main difference between both these cars are um, the, the novice cars have outward suspension and the uh, FOs, the pro cars have inward suspension. And so, you know, the handling changes quite a bit. And the, no, the novice cars would be more oversteery, there's more weight in the back and it, it would just be, uh, you know, a little bit unpredictable. But these cars are more un understeery and a little bit predictable. Okay. But overall, they still, they drive similar, but they're not similar. Okay. And I think so these are like very tough cars to tame, right? They're all over the place. You have to be a real driver to you. I yeah. guess you have to manhandle them basically. Yeah, so these cars have no electronical aids of whatsoever. Right. Everything is raw, everything is mechanical. We got hitch pattern gearbox. And you know, there's no traction control, no nothing. Yeah. The ECUs are locked, absolutely nothing. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, it's a pure driver based uh, yeah. thing. Whoever's up there, it's just basically they just got God level drivers yeah. from out of India. Cool, cool. Thank you so much. All the best. Is your race next up? Yeah. Okay. All the best for it. Thank you. incredible weekend over here at Curry Motor Speedway with JK Tire Motorsports. The last race that we just saw, it had lots of drama, lots of hardcore racing. Uh, unfortunately, our boy Chetan, uh, he got a little injured, a car mounted on top of him, so he fractured his hand. Even Mira Erda from M Sport had a pretty big incident, but luckily everyone is safe. The safety car, the medical car and all of the team over here at Curry Motor Speedway and JK Tires, you know, handled it very brilliantly. No one got hurt, everyone is safe. You know, cars get damaged, that's part and parcel of motorsport. So, uh, if you have some uh, spare time, I would genuinely suggest that you come down to an event like this, especially the JK NRC. They've been doing this for the longest time. They've been pushing grassroots level racing in India since like the last 26 years. This is the 26th edition of it. So uh, give them a follow on Instagram. Subscribe to our channel. Follow us on Instagram. Comment down below what you think and I'll catch you in the next one. And I feel